Hey guys, Chris from Big Red Homestead. It's been a while since we had any videos put out, so I thought I'd do a little update. Um, well, one of the newest additions is our, we have a new sow on the farm. This is, uh, we are calling her Chidiso. She's actually the mother of one of our, our other sows that we have. Um, got them from a friend, and with the intention is when she has a litter, if they choose, they can get a pick of the litter. So, got her. She's three, four hundred pounds. She's hard to move. One of the newest additions. Just eating a bunch of apples that all fell from the tree today. We also got a new little Jersey heifer. So, I call her buttercream, but the kids call her, call her buttermilk. But she's only, she's only six months old or so. Bertha's getting in the way. There she is. So there's buttercream. So the plan is to have her take over as the, the milker. And eventually we will, we will probably end up selling Bertha and Bessie over here. We also have three new, three new birds on the farm. We got a tom turkey and a couple of hens. And one of the local families that we know, they um, kind of traded. We traded a piglet for the three turkeys. So that's kind of the newest, newest things on the farm. It's kind of an overcast day today. We've been needing rain. For, we haven't had a whole lot of rain over the last month, so it's much needed. Um, I take you over to the garden, let you see what the garden looks like. It's starting to come in really nice. All the rain that we've had this week and had a little bit of last week, I've definitely put it into overdrive. So here we are in the garden. You can see the tomatoes are doing well. Got a couple of rows of tomatoes. Peppers are kind of struggling. We started them in, indoors and we probably kept them in the plant, plant or in the containers too long. Some of them are doing okay. Those are the peppers. Got rows of snap peas right here. They're starting to climb. I believe that's a broccoli. And we got cucumbers. We need to get up a trellis for the cucumbers pretty soon because they're starting to sprawl out all over the place. And some we have some lettuce growing down this row. And there's Gordy with picking some weeds. We've got the green beans right here. Over here we got more either broccoli or cauliflower. We got some Squashes. squash, zucchini. Squash. Over here. I just look how two weeks ago these things were half the size, so the water was much needed. And then over here we have a couple raised beds on the outside of the fence. We've got our potatoes in the raised bed. The ground here is really clay, a lot of clay, so we had to do a raised bed and kind of add some good quality soil. This is Tessa's little herb garden over here. She's got basil, dill, sage. What else, Tess? Um, there's parsley and thyme in there. And then on the other side of the potatoes, we have our other roots. We have our onions and I believe some carrots in between. The chickens got into this before we fenced them in, so we probably lost a couple carrots in there. But starting to come in strong. That's just a little bit of what's going on on, on the homestead. So I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.